What'd you say? Hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm Brittany. And I'm Brad. And we are Audio Show. Before we start, make sure to click that red button down below to subscribe to our channel. And also hit that little bell so you can stay up to date whenever we release a new episode. And if you want to be a member of our Patreon community, you can find the information in our description below. Mm. This is our first spooky read of the season. And we had no idea. No. We're going to be reviewing Evil Eye by Madari Shaker. This is Audible. Written by Madhuri Shaker. And it is an audio drama Ooh. produced by Audible. And it was one of our frees. Yes. Each month, because we have an Audible account, we get two free Audible originals. And this is one of them we just grabbed. And we did not expect it whatsoever. It is a full cast of characters. There's about four main characters in the book, uh, but it is just intense. There's a lot of... Mm. action there's a lot of sound effects oh. it's so so cool and this one is for adults we've mm -hmm. listened to previous audio dramas um that were a little bit more geared toward kids um or preteens teenagers yeah. but this one is definitely for adults yes. it has uh, abuse it has language yes and then also talks about the development of of women in yes. our society yes the expectations of marriage mm -hmm. and arranged marriage yeah. from different cultures yeah and it also talks about the cultural karmas that some places uh, view mm -hmm. as being true and how they deal with those, what they think. Um, and it is just, oh my God. Oh, so good. So cool. So it's about two hours long, give or take. Yeah. And it's a play. So if you like plays, this is going to be perfect for you. Audio dramas are coming back. Yes. And I am so excited about that because I love the radio drama podcasts and everything. Mm -hmm. And I feel like those are just, they're so cool. It makes me feel like I'm in the 40s again. Yeah. Again? You don't know how old I am. You're right. You're right. <laughs> So Evil Eye is about a mom and daughter relationship. Mm -hmm. The mother is based in India. She moved back to India with her husband and she is calling and checking in on her daughter, trying to see where her relationships are, hoping that she'll get married mm -hmm. and hoping that she can set her up with a marriage. But the daughter is a strong-willed woman and she won't have an arranged marriage. No. So she goes about trying to find love herself. And she does with Sandy. This book made me think of, <laughs> it had a lot going on, but it made me realize, man, I'm not the only person that's enmeshed with her mother. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. <laughs> I'm like, she's worse than me. <laughs> so the whole book takes place via phone calls or voicemails. And you really get a sense of the relationship and how it starts breaking down at a certain mm. point um, because of the mother's beliefs in who Sandeep is. Mm -hmm. um, and there's a lot of trauma that you deal with, yeah. with the mother, a lot that the daughter figures out along with the audience. And it's just really interesting. Mm -hmm. There are sound effects. There is like walking around there's rain sounds the there's phone doors, ringing there's phone rings. everyone has a different phone ring so you know yes. exactly who is calling when yes uh at certain points um the daughter's father tries to call her and you get her voicemail and you get her voicemail about three or four times and you just hear the same voicemail over and over and over again mm -hmm. it doesn't change it's pre-recorded it's just such a cool detail to mm -hmm. have this voicemail in there this goes hand in hand with an evidence of of the affair by taylor yes. reed jenkins or is it taylor jenkins reed taylor jenkins reed oopsie mm -hmm. but it goes hand in hand with that epistolary concept yes that in that, in uh, evidence of an affair, it's letters, but in Evil Eye, it was voicemails and phone calls. Yes. Very it's modern. Very, very weird. There's one part in the book towards the end mm -hmm. where I'm like, how was that a voicemail? Oh, I noticed. Yes. The part, yes. Yeah. The you dinner. Know what I'm talking about. The, the dinner. dinner. <laughs> the dinner. I was like, who, like, did she record this? I like, think she was recording it for the police husband. Police evidence? Or police evidence, yes. Or I the think, husband. <laughs> or the husband. I don't know. That was a little weird. It was a little weird. But I was there for it. I was like... Because I was like, this definitely incriminates people. Yes. <laughs> and not just this one person that you're trying to incriminate. Exactly. I was like, ooh. Oh, God. But yeah, so this chilling play will have you on the edge of your seat. Oh, God. I love that you call it a play. Yes. I love that you called it a because play. Because I was like imagining it. And oh. every, every voicemail, every phone call, I was just like, oh, my God, I'm there. I'm the line that connects the little cup to the cup and you put it to the ear and put it to the ear and then I'm there. 
It was so good. Oh my god! And to the fact that it is an Audible original、mm-hmm. and that it was a free book that we just picked up because we were like, oh, this is the most interesting looking. Cover、mm-hmm. because usually with the Audible originals, if you're an Audible member、yeah. and you get the free two credits, you can relate to us in saying that the books usually don't look that appealing. They don't, and actually, you picked this one out. Oh, it、did. was one week where you kind of like you took over the the two, which is fine by me because sometimes I pick the worst ones. I mean, and then I was like, same ones. Wait, wait, yeah, we usually pick the same ones, but I was like, what is she doing? What is this one about? Listen to it. Winner, you get next month. Okay, okay. Oh, and it's gonna be October. Yes. <gasps> oh. Last year they had a whole bunch of free, like, like there was like ten free ones. Oh my god, I'm excited. So I'm excited. And another one that we want to talk about in a future episode is the Mystery of Alice,、mm. which was another Audible original. So Audible is bringing back the the、yeah. plays and the audio dramas,、yeah. and they are really bringing their A game.、Mm-hmm. <laughs> so yeah, they are doing an amazing, amazing stuff over there. Um, I know we were hating on them with our little discussion of, of captions, which I still stand by. But we can't, we can't hate that they are making good content. Yeah. So definitely pick this up this fall. It's、mm-hmm. going to be probably one of our top fall reads. Yes. Which we'll have another episode on later.、Mm-hmm. But definitely pick this chilling story up. Oh. Yes. So so good. It's going to give me nightmares. I know. I had a nightmare about it because、mm-hmm. I was listening to this. After I took some Nyquil because I thought I was getting sick yesterday,、mm-hmm. and so I was in that sort of like stupor where I was、oh, yeah. like falling asleep but still listening, and so like I had a dream where like my mom was trying to like get on a plane to save me, but I was like in the ocean, and I was like, "What are you doing here, mom?" Interesting. It made me want to call my mother and say, "Thank you for not calling me like this mom does." <laughs> But then Eddie was like,、eh, "Are you sure about that? Because she does call you a lot." Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we're gonna shelf it. We're shelving this and share it with our moms. Love you, mom. Love you too, <laughs> mom. <laughs> my mom watches our videos. Oh, really? Yeah. My mom doesn't have a computer. <laughs> my mom watches them at work when she's supposed to be working. Oh yeah, that's what I do. So I'm sure as soon as she gets to this part in the video, she's gonna call me and be laughing. <laughs> Good. This is for future. Hi, Brittany's mom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we are shelving this. We hope that you pick it up, and we hope that you enjoy it. We also want to hear from you if you do pick it up and how much you love it. You can follow us on Twitter at Audio Shelf Me, Instagram at Audio Shelf Me, and Facebook at Audio Shelf.、Mm-hmm. If you want to become a patron member of ours and join that community, you can find the information down below.、Mm-hmm. And what else can they do down below? They can Ooh, also、oh、subscribe.、God. Yeah. That's what they can do with the red button. Until next time. Bye. Bye.